Hi, it's Michael Davis of Speaking CPR with your daily dose of public speaking wisdom. In your last piece of wisdom, you heard all about ideas on how to properly open your speech so that you'll grab people's attention and keep their interest. Well, this is a bonus tip. This is my favorite way to open a presentation, whether I use a story, a question, a quote, or a startling statement or statistic. This has never failed me. When I get to the front of a room and the introducer has left the stage, this is what I do. I don't say anything for as long as I feel is proper. Now, why in the world would you start a speech with silence? Think about what was discussed in the last tip. Audiences have expectations, and as you get to the front of the room and you sound like every other person, they begin to check out on you. I mean, they literally start thinking about something else because subconsciously they feel like, oh, I've already heard this. How often do you see a speaker step to the front of the room and say nothing? That alone makes you different. But let's take a quick look at what it does for you, the speaker, and what it does for the audience. When you can stand in front of an audience and people are staring at you and you say nothing, that conveys confidence. It shows that you own the stage, you own the speaking area. What does it do for the audience? Well, imagine you're sitting in the room, somebody walks to the front of the stage and they're just standing there smiling, saying nothing. Whatever was going on in your mind before is going to get pushed to the side because the audience is thinking, well, what's his deal? Well, why is she just standing there? Or better, oh, the poor thing, he forgot what he was going to say. Guess what? I, had, I, I don't care what they're thinking, as long as their eyes are focused to the front of the room. If you want to give this a name, call it the put the phone down technique. What this means is, some people in the audience are looking at their phones as you're being introduced. Others want to. Well, when you're standing up there, quietly smiling with confidence, they're going to set their phones down, put them in their pockets or stick them in a purse. And that's what you want. You want them focusing on you. Now, your first words are important, but when you start with silence, I promise you, it will give you the attention you want. You will break their thought patterns and they'll know there's something different about you and they'll be ready to listen to the next thing you have to say. Do this. I promise it works. And please, give me some feedback. Let me know how it works for you. I'll see you in your next daily dose of public speaking wisdom.